Hey guys, this is Jamie with PC Monkey, bringing you another do-it-yourself computer repair video today. Uh, today we're working on a laptop computer that's getting a runtime error. Let me zoom in and show you what that error looks like, although you probably already know because it's on your computer. Uh, so this is the runtime error that we're getting right now. So we're going to show you a couple different fixes for how to fix this error and, and get rid of it. Uh, as we become aware of other fixes, uh, as we verify that they work, we'll make some more videos and we'll put those links in the description below um, if these two fixes don't resolve your issue. If you have any questions, uh, check out the frequently asked questions in the description. Uh, or if you don't see it, leave your questions and we can uh, we try to get back to you a couple times a day at, at least. So the first fix that we're going to show you is we're going to close out of these errors. We're going to make sure that your computer is updated. Uh, therefore, making sure your drivers are updated because this can sometimes be related to a graphics driver issue. So go down to your search bar down here as I've done. Type in updates. You're going to get this popping up. Check for updates under system settings. That's what we want. So hit enter. So this can look a few different ways. You'll either see it look like mine. It'll say you're up to date and it won't show any updates. In that case, click on check for updates. Um, don't necessarily believe this. Always check for updates manually. So we're going to go ahead and click on that. Another way that could look is you'll see a list of updates and they'll start running by themselves. You'll see some that says pending download. You'll see some say like 5% and then as you watch it, it'll say 10% downloaded, 15%. So that's good. Or you'll see a list of updates that won't be running. They'll just be listed. Scroll down and hit download to manually start those. But in our case, we are up to date. I manually checked and nothing came up, so you're good. So that's the first step you would do is to make sure your computer, uh, your computer and therefore your drivers are updated. After you've done that, if the error still persists, come back down to the search bar here and type in CMD. We're going to go for the command prompt, which pops up. Hit enter. Now you're going to type in a very specific command here. I'm going to zoom in so you can see it. And uh, I will also post this command in the description so you can copy and uh, paste it. But it's BC edit. Sorry, BCD edit. I always forget the D. Space forward slash set. Space increase. USE RVA space 2800. So that's the command you would write in. Again, I'll put that in the description. Uh, hit enter <clears throat> just in that one command and it should say um, this command has run successfully or this command has been successfully completed. That usually fixes a good 75% of these runtime errors. Uh, so those are the two fixes that we have for you today on this issue. Again, as we find other fixes and we confirm that they work, um, we'll post a couple other videos um, and we'll put the links in the description. Uh, but for now, uh, if this was helpful and if it solved your problem, please like and share. Any questions or uh, comments, please leave it in the description. And uh, please subscribe if you enjoy do-it-yourself computer repair. Thanks for watching.